Sam sold his iPod at a loss of 10%. If he had sold it for $44 more, he would have made 12% profit. So yeah, there are two situations. Uh, so let us start with the first situation. So the first situation is he is making a loss of 10%. So we'll start like this. The cost price is $100. Let us start. Or so we'll say let the cost price be 100 So there's a loss of 10%. Loss of 10%. So 10% of 100 is $10. That is pretty easy. So the selling price, so the selling price would be uh, cost price minus the loss. Okay, so in the first situation, the selling price is 100 take away 10, which is $90. Okay, let us take the second situation. Let us take the second situation. The second situation, what they're saying is, let us not look at the 44, let us ignore that 44. So the second situation is clear that he would have made a 12% profit. So again, let us start with, let the cost price be, say $100. He's making a profit of 12%. So 12% of 100 is again 12. So the selling price is cost price plus the profit cost price plus the profit. So in the second situation, the selling price is $112. So here it says, this can also be read that there is a difference of $44. If he had sold it, it would have been $44 more. In other words, what they're saying is, the difference between the first, situ uh, the first situation and the second situation, or the difference between the second and the first situation is, $44. So let us find the difference. So the difference between the two situations is 112 take away 90. So this is $22. So the difference is $22. So let us make now an example of proportion. So let us say the difference and the cost price. So we can see if the difference is 22 or when the difference is 22 the cost price is 100 so the difference is how much 44 so using proportion 22 this is how many times this is becoming how many times this is becoming this is doubling so if this is doubles this has also to double so the cost price of the watch of the iPod is okay. Therefore, you can say the cost price of iPod is 200 rupees, 200 dollars. I keep saying rupees for some reason. Okay, now we always need to check whether the answer is right or wrong. So, so let us start like this. So, the cost price is 200 dollars. Okay. So the first situation, so the first situation, let us take the first situation, the loss of 10%, loss of 10%, 10% of 200 is $20, that is because it is one tenth, $20 here. So the selling price would be 200 take away 20, which is $180. In the second situation, the second situation, you have a cost price of, you have a cost price of 200, so you've got a profit of, profit of 12%. So let us find without the calculator. So 10% of 200 is 20. So 10% is 20. So 1% 1 is 100 is $2. So 2% is $4. So 12%, if you want to do without the calculator, is $24. So what's the selling price here? The selling price is $224. Because selling price is cost price plus profit. So what's the difference now? 
difference is 224 take away 180 which is 44 dollars so we have checked our answer and it's and